so the materials used are silicone mold clear resin hard knob which i'm going to use in the two is to one ratio then a bowl and spoon for measurement and mixing then a set of sequins which is optional Always make sure to wear a gloves before starting the work because the resin and hardener are sticky which will get onto your hands and it's not comfortable to work with a sticky hand. And also the chemicals present in the resin may hurt your skin so it's better to use gloves. Also make sure to work in a properly ventilated place which is most important for the resin work. Here I am taking two portions of resin and one portion of hardener that is two spoons of clear resin and one spoon of hardener This hardener shouldn't be too much or too little because both will affect the curing of resin. Start mixing the resin and hardener for about 3 to 5 minutes so that it gets mixed evenly which helps in proper setting of the resin. So before pouring the resin, make sure the mold is neat and clean without any dust particles. We can wipe off the dust particle using a paintbrush or so. I'm going to use this resin art for a scrapbook. So I'll pour the resin in thin layers. I had this leftover sequin mix from my previous project. I'll be adding few more colors to it, mix it together and use for this. Start adding the sequin mix to the letters. After this step, we will let it cure for 24 to 48 hours. Usually it gets dried in 24 hours but 48 hours for the best result. Carefully taking out the lettuce from the mold and it's all dried up.